Island Kitchen. Today, I'm going to show you how to cook Hyderabad Dam Biryani. So, let's see the recipes. Well, for the chicken biryani, I have here 1 kilo of bone-in chicken. And now, I'm going to start for the marination. I have lemon juice, ginger garlic paste, gram masala powder, and saffron with milk green chilies red chili powder yellow yellow powder and salt we'll put it together coriander and mint leaves one cup of fried onions if, if you want you can use the uh, fresh fried onion for me I have ready made fried onions uh, you will uh, use the uh, cinnamon stick uh, cardamom seed cloves zira and one cup of oil it's a normal cooking oil and one cup of yogurt all the ingredient is already uh, added and you will mix it well all together just combine all the ingredients If you think that all the ingredients are combined well, and you will cover it with the plate. Okay, all the mixture is uh, combined well, and you will uh, cover it, and you will marinate it for at least two hours. If you want to marinate for overnight, that will be much better. It will be more taste uh, tasty. So let's wait for uh, two hours. While we are waiting for the chicken marination, we have to soak the rice for at least 30 minutes. Now we have already soaked rice for 30 minutes. So this is the time to boil the water for the rice. Now water is started boiling. So I'm going to add the spices. Start from the bay leaves, cumin seed, cloves, cardamom seed, cinnamon stick, and one tablespoon of salt and two tablespoon of oil and coriander and mint leaves then i'm going to add the rice This is one kilo of rice. Now the rice is boiled for three minutes. So in this situation, we will take half of the boiled rice on the top of the chicken. We spread it out and we'll take some more rice.
okay after five minutes boiling of this leftover rice now we are going to take out from the pot and we will add it from the top just spread it over all the rice Now we add already all the rice inside the pot. So now I'm going to add the ghee. This is saffron with milk. Green chili. And fry onions gram masala powder coriander and mint leaves and now we will close it we will seal with the foil now we will cook for five minutes with high flame now five uh, first five minutes are done so now we are going to cook for another 10 minutes with the low flame now tower is already heated so now i'm going to Put the pot on the top of the tower and we will cook it for uh, at least 30 minutes. Now 30 minutes cooking time is uh, done. So we will keep this pot without opening the lid at least 10 minutes more. Now 10 minutes uh, completely done. So we will start open the lid. Let's check it. How is it? Oh, the smell is so good when you start open the lid you can smell already so nice this is our biryani it's completely done the rice is well cooked also so now you will just turn it the rice slowly by slowly without breaking the rice you will see the the color This is the gravy from the base. Just mix it a little bit. Now our biryani is already dished out. So this is the time to taste the uh, chicken and the rice. Let's check. You can see the chicken, the softness. Yeah, it's very soft and very juicy. So let's taste it. Mm. The spices, the flavor, everything is perfect. I hope you like my recipe. If you like it, you can try it at home. And don't forget to like and comment below. And don't forget to subscribe as well. Thank you. Bye-bye.